Anna from Ask Anna. About a year ago, I refinished our tub and tile surround with the Rust-Oleum Tub and Tile Transformation Kit, and I have had so many questions since then on how it's doing, how it's holding up, and um, a few other things, so I wanted to address those questions today and just do a review of how I feel about the product a year later. So, to start off, you can see that it still looks amazing. Still white, it's not pink, <laughs> didn't go back. Um, it still looks great and it's held up really well. So some of the specific questions that I've had um, are, is the, has it started peeling at all? And it has not started peeling. Um, I actually have put it to the test. I do not go easy on it when I clean it because when I clean it, I want it scrubbed clean. So um, I use a Scotch-Brite with the green scrub brush on the back. I scrub it really good, um, and as far as what I use to clean it, I just use, I mean, I've used lots of different products, but um, any bathroom product um, spray will work, and it hasn't been a problem. It stayed clean, and it's totally held up to the test of um, cleaning and scrubbing and all of that stuff. So um, somebody also wanted to know if I painted the grout, and the answer is yes. I did paint the grout. I don't know if you can see. I'll post a picture, but... Um, all of the grout is painted white as well as the same color and um, for me I felt like it was easier because our grout was kind of a dingy off-white color and I didn't think it would look good with the bright white of the product so I went ahead cleaned the grout really well and then I also painted it to match the tub and it has made it so much easier not having to clean and scrub the grout because it's just easy to wipe down like the rest of the bathtub um, Let's see. Oh, another question I had was, will it work on fiberglass? Um, I believe this product is made to work on a fiberglass tub. Um, we actually have one downstairs. It's a shower insert that is also pink. <laughs> and I haven't had a chance to redo it, but that is my plan to redo the um, fiberglass. I think it is made for both. Um, I have not personally used it on a fiberglass shower, but um, seeing how well it is held up on our porcelain tub and tile, I believe that it would hold up just as well on fiberglass. Um, I will say also that since I did this a few or last year, it's been almost a year, I have recommended this to a handful of friends, all of which have been very, very happy with how theirs has turned out as well. I will say it does take a little bit of time for the smell to go away because this the product smells wretched. It's horrible. Um, but if you've got a good exhaust fan and a window, like we have a window in our bathroom, it went away after a couple of days. So that takes a little getting used to for the first couple days, but I have been so happy with it and it has been worth the smell to enjoy how pretty it has um, stayed and just how clean and modern. Like everybody that I show cannot believe that this tub and the tile surround used to be pink. So I definitely recommend this product. My friends that have used it also recommend it. They love it um, and has also held up very well for them. So if you have any other questions, please feel free to leave me a question in the comments and I will get back to you. But I wanted to address some of these um, questions that I did today just because I've heard them over and over again throughout the last year. And I just wanted to show you how well the product is holding up and I'll post some pictures too so you can see up close how well it's really doing. But I hope this helps. I hope it answers some of your questions. And if you paint your tub, I would love to see. I've had a reader send me a before and after picture of the tub that they did, and it looked amazing. I was so happy for them. So if you do yours, I'd love to see it. And um, like I said, if you have any other questions, please feel free to leave it in the comments. Thank you.